Hello everyone, and welcome back to Universe Sim. And oh, look at that! Look at that, they're really doing it! They're really doing it! Oh my gosh, they are building my evolution tower! So, we just finished researching the brand new two-door architecture for our little researching tree last time, and I was a little distracted, I will admit, at looking over what was going on with uh, a little a little herbologist who I have really fallen for, one of our witch doctors in a hospital. She had quite the interesting love story last time, and I'm keeping a good eye on her. But uh, I turn around, and my evolution tower is being upgraded without me. So this is really cool, and I have no idea what it's going to look like when it's done. But this is the center point of our entire civilization, so I assume that it's like a really important thing to have upgraded. And maybe once it's upgraded, everybody will start upgrading their stone huts. So instead of stone huts, they might upgrade to say the two-door architecture, which would be really cool. So we're gonna keep an eye on them. And then hopefully later today, we will also have couriers researched so that I can start sending those guys around to collect up different resources and to hopefully drop them off in the correct places. And we're also trying to expand uh, the edges of our civilization because I wanna see just how many people our populations can support. So far, it seems the only thing that's really limiting us is the fact that we actually have um, old age really getting to us. Otherwise, old age and the occasional tornado are the only problems I really have. And it looks like we have a bunch of displaced wildlife I might need to do something about. So far, I don't think I've lost anybody to wildlife. We can check on... We can check on the graves in a little bit to make sure. Do I have anybody making anything over there? I do. They're supposed to be making a bunch of herbs for my witch doctors to be able to harvest. But does it not work? Huh. We'll check that out in a minute. But look at my evolution tower. It's almost done. While you guys are over here, could you upgrade my temple? Nobody believes in me anymore. I think it's because my temple is so... Uh, Oh no, oh no, my water pump! My water pump is like falling apart. I'll have to go ahead and check that out in a little bit. But I want to see what my tower looks like when it's finished. And what happens once once it does become finished. Which water pump is falling apart? I should have everything more or less covered by engineers. Are they harvesting that? Okay, I'm gonna have to check on that. Alright, so down we go. People are, yeah, people seem to die of old age more than anything else. So I wonder how I can encourage them to have more babies. Are you married? Oh, that's why. Maybe I need to start becoming the goddess of romance and making sure that everyone is married. Because it looks like not many of my nuggets are married. Ha! Huh. All right. Maybe that's how we can get the population up. <gasps> and here we go, guys. Da na na na. It looks fantastic. It has a little bell to ring. We have got all sorts of uh, oh pieces around it. We have got everything upgraded. My evolution tower is finished. Ta-da! I really like it. So I wonder if that means that my nuggets will start upgrading their houses too. No idea. I hope so because that would be kind of cool. Uh, in fact, all of the architecture being upgraded would be kind of cool. But there it is. Huh. So I wonder what we're going to do now. Hmm. Well, all right. So we're going to wait for couriers. And I might want to start playing like the, the goddess of love. Because it seems many of my nuggets are not in relationships. And I want them to be so they have lots and lots of babies. All right, come on. Lots and lots of babies, please. Okay, everybody there had spouses, you lucky, lucky ducks. We have like a bear migration going down through here. So I'm not sure what to do about that. I'm sure it's fine. We have got a lot of food. I think I have more than enough food, so I don't really need to worry about that. But, and we have a warehouse tucked on this corner. And I have some nuggets trying to build things over here for me. So do I need, I might go ahead and build like a well. Well, I have a well right there. Maybe, maybe a water reservoir. Because I want them to start building some houses over here. But now that I think about it, I've never really seen anybody build houses over on this side, even though we've had people here. So I wonder, maybe if I put down like some local businesses. Here, maybe if I, yeah, let's try sticking like a local business for everybody to enjoy. Right next to the restaurant, right there. And then maybe I can like put a school over here. 
and then people can start like educating themselves. There's a little hut over here. Yeah, let's go ahead and put a school in this direction. Are you guys growing food? I think they are. All right, what about over here? Yeah, I think they are. So we'll put in a school, we'll put in some some uh, businesses, the cosmetics, and I guess the real problem, and over here we've got tons and tons of food, and they should be growing some of the herbs, but I guess one of the biggest problems is actually that we're running out of, of wood. I don't really have the ability for a lot of my nuggets to collect up as much wood as they need to, because we have all of our wood over here. So maybe if I put... I wonder if I can put, like, a wood refinery over... I guess it wouldn't be a wood refinery. Would it be a wood refinery? Probably. I wonder if I can move them, like, closer? Oh, and I need the wind turbine, but I don't know what for what yet. Seeing as the wind is so determined to ruin their hairstyles every day, Nuggets decided they might as well make the best of the situation. Wind turbines, or windmills as they're more commonly known, will help your civilization power through natural means. However, a lack of wind can severely diminish their efficiency. Think of it like you're on a sailboat. Without wind, you're stuck in the middle of the ocean, surrounded by sharks and in the midst of an uncertain future. Hmm. And then a small wind turbine, but I don't actually think we have anything yet that we need to worry about having energy for. Right now, we just are going to work on a library for the archive upgrade, and we're getting rounded cogs so that we can improve the water wheel output and the water pump output for screws. We're going to do government so that it can have a town hall, and oh wait, we have to have blacksmith can i still get the town hall without a blacksmith well we're gonna find out oh good now those herbs are growing so we'll actually get that done good 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 we'll actually get that done for my doctor and then the doctor can just come straight over here look at that 15 herbs already up and going she is ready that's fantastic i need more food or i need more wood that's really the the thing that limits me more than anything else is that my nuggets don't have any wood hmm are they doing okay here? Yeah, oh, courier is complete. <gasps> okay, what do we do with them? Where are they? Come here. My precious, wonderful couriers, where are you? Cemetery, oh, a little bit of lag. Watchtower, archive, the town hall that we're working on. Actually, couriers is a really good question. Gas mine, small wind turbine. Reservoir, warehouse, battery, courier's hut. The flow of resources is essential to the smooth operation of your civilization. Whether it's a construction site waiting for materials, a refinery lacking things to refine, or simply someone looking for a shipment of fresh fish, couriers are the answer. They deliver anything and everything, no questions asked. Okay, so we wanna work on those. Phew, all right, we got babies popping up. And it might take me a while to get to the couriers. What is this? This is the hunter's hut. It is finally empty. We're going to go ahead and demolish the building then. And I'll put a courier in right there. Because this is actually kind of uh, at a center point of our civilization where the iron mines and the refineries are nearby too. So let's get the courier's hut. I'm going to go ahead and build it right here. And then we're going to go ahead and prioritize it. It's going to need refined wood and refined stone. Hopefully we will have people constructing it pretty soon. They'll be out and about collecting things. And otherwise, I think what I want to work on is making sure there's plenty of romance happening amongst my younger nuggets so that we can get lots and lots of babies. Let's see, and this guy is off for a drink of water. That guy is off, he's making the babies. No, not another tornado. Is it gonna come from over there again? I wish there was something that I could do to like protect my nuggets. All I have is like this, this rainstorm effect that I hope does something. All right, good, the wells are doing good. Where are you going if you're, is this how it all ends? Well then get inside the like actual, if that's how you guys are gonna be about it, get inside, yeah, good, good. So he's taking care of his food and his water here at the restaurant, which is nice. They're taking care of it too. I mean, I have a bunker, but no one ever uses the bunkers. Is it turned on? Huh. 
Okay, hopefully the bunker's turned on and like if the tornado comes this way, I think it's over here. Let's follow this little line. No. Yeah, hopefully if it comes over here, my nuggets will be safe. Where is the tornado? On the other side of the planet? That'd be convenient. And I might be able to convince my nuggets to like come up through the mountains. That would be really cool. We have so many rocks in these mountains. Oh my gosh. And come over to the other side. That, that'd be a fun challenge to see how you could expand your city further away. But we're definitely going to need couriers if we're going to do that. Alright, so far so good on the whole tornado thing. How's this? Good. I don't think we need two grave keepers. So I'm going to unassign this nugget. In fact, I don't think we need this many graves. Like these, this many cemeteries at the moment. So I'm actually going to go ahead and we're going to turn this off. And release this nugget. And this cemetery is going to be temporarily closed down. Because I don't think we need it. Huzzah! My nuggets are able to stay alive. I'm so happy. Alright. We're getting the couriers built. The tornado did not come to destroy my town. I am pleased by that. Is everybody having babies? Yeah, she's carrying stuff. She's already got babies. What about you? Huh, this man doesn't have any romance in his life. Whoops, I about made it rain on him instead. I'm going to fix that. Come here, good sir. Boom. Uh, I don't know who to pair you with, though. She's married. She's married. She's married. He is not married. She's married. She's married. She's married to you. Dang it, everybody's like paired off. Wait, 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 here's a woman. Who needs, okay. Okay, let's get you. And I guess anybody, anybody, who, who am I gonna connect you to? Are all of the glowing spots uh, maybe single nuggets? And, yay, oh, a nugget believes I'm real. <gasps> Through romance. Ah! Oh my gosh, wait, 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 wait. So if I make them fall in love, then they'll start believing in me? Because that's really cool. And you can see where I've, I've paired these two up. They're now married. Hopefully they'll have many, many children. It's like rainbow arcs of romance just overhead. Uh oh, is that the tornado? Wow. And I think you can see like the other pairings I've had too. So right, the courier's hut. Let's actually see. I want to see maybe the nuggets who are like workaholics. And maybe the smart nuggets. So like the workaholic smart nuggets I'm going to assign to being at the courier's hut. And then I guess we can figure out like what does that mean they do? That's a good question I think. Alright, it's raining a little bit. So what do you do? Mirage is a tricky and ice cream. She's carrying a whole bunch of food. Why is there this creepy music? I was the goddess of love. I don't deserve this. <laughs> Alright, and she says she doesn't have anything to do. But she's carrying a bunch of food. And now we just kind of have to follow her to see what she's doing. We're building this school. We need more wood for it. And the wood is just really far away. This doesn't seem terribly efficient. But let's watch her for a second. So she took a bunch of food from some of, like, one of the houses and brought it over here. Huh. I don't know about that. Is that how you're supposed to make couriers work? Or do you put them on two different locations? Doing nothing and waiting for. Oh, and you need, like, a little bit of power for them. Oh, and I don't have any power. All right, let's go ahead and try building a wind turbine. Uh, let's see. And where should I build it? This is kind of a tricky part. I might have to destroy a house or two. It's not personal nuggets. I'm sorry. It's just like, you know, we saw a tornado here once. Does that make you feel better? Let's see. Where can I build this near my courier's hut? Because I don't know how the inner, like how close does it have to be? Well, I guess we could go ahead and try building it over here. Just like in the fields. And I could move a courier's hut over here if I need to. Need to. But let's try building it, I guess, this direction, maybe? Or like this direction? I'm not really sure if there's a good spot to build it. We're gonna need iron, let's prioritize. 
All right, so we're gonna work on wind, but I also want more nuggets. I want the populations to go way, way up. So I wonder, can I search out who is not in love? <laughs> can you search by that? Can you search for like who isn't in a romantic relationship? I can search by the little icons I give the nuggets, which is kind of cool. Whoa, and then we have a little bit of an autosave like hiccup there. So don't mind that, but I, I wonder if we want our population to go up actually. I don't know if we're designed to hold. Ah, somebody who's single. All right, got this one, got this one. And then I think the purple are like the single, the single um, females. And the blue are the single males. Can I connect you two? Do you believe in me now? Oh, he had a child already. Maybe his wife died of old age. I'm gonna assume. I'm gonna assume. I like the idea that I can make them fall in love, but can I make ones who are already are married fall in love? I cannot. Thank goodness. There's so many romances to be had here. Here, you're not dead yet. You're old enough to have a child. Hurry up. Hurry up with it. Oh, I'm gonna be the goddess of love and hopefully have so many more nugget babies. And hopefully they'll believe in me more. All right, what about you? And you. Just whoever I can grab is good at this point. Yeah, they don't have any kids yet, but they're about to. He already had three kids, but I guess he didn't have a mate. I'm gonna like triple check on that actually. Okay, what about this woman? She has no one in her life. I have a lot of girls who need mates, but not a lot of boys, I just realized. Uh, what about this guy back here? What about him? All right, so he's just old, but he doesn't have a mate. You, you, okay, come here. All right, buddy, you, and then I know there was a female down here. Ha, yes, I am pairing them off. And hopefully I'll have more nuggets as a result. Uh, and many new nuggets are now adults. Hopefully we can start pushing the population up higher, getting more things done a little faster. And I'm also going to make it spring because I am the goddess of spring. And I do have, ah, it's not winter yet, so I can't do that. Uh, and I do have a lot of nuggets who believe in me. Oh, and we need nuggets working the iron mines. What is going on? Why aren't you guys working the iron mines, eh? Government research is complete. There we go. All right. The snows and the winds are starting to come in. I think this is actually a really good spot for wind energy is what I'm being told. So like this spot seems okay too. Yeah, look at all this. I'm just taking a guess. Actually, I think it's trees. I think it's the outline of trees being blown across the way, which is kind of interesting. But all right, so I am now officially the goddess of love, spreading all sorts of uh, romance amongst my nuggets. And it turns out I have a lot of, a lot of single female nuggets and I need more, I need more male nuggets or else I won't be able to pair them off as easily to convince them to have children but I'm pairing them off left and right and it's finally making Nuggets believe that I am real and hopefully get on the way of having more babies, which would be really fantastic. And the wind turbine is fully operational. That is awesome. I have no idea what I'm gonna do with that energy. The school can't operate without water. Uh, my water reserves are apparently almost tapped already. Holy days. That's kind of impressive it happened so fast. And uh, right down here, my, yeah, my wind energy is, is actually going. So we've had a lot going on today. <laughs> oh my gosh, we have had a lot, a lot, a lot going on today. And I'm kind of curious to see where things are gonna go from here. But yeah, right now, we've got more people, more brand new nuggets being born left and right. I have some nuggets saying that they can't do their jobs. Like this guy can't be a grave digger, why not, huh? I guess there's like, she's got a body. Where's your body, huh? Huh. <laughs> and this person, are you a courier? I think she's a courier and she's like carrying things back and forth to where they need to go actually. Huh, maybe, is she going to the warehouse? Because if that's the case, I don't really need those fancy things at the warehouse. Interesting. So I'm gonna wanna really manage my resources better over here at the warehouse because I don't really need these kinds of things. I need, I need like more detailed things. So, huh. All right, we might have to start managing the workflow amongst our warehouse. 
I think that that was a really light winter. We're already pushing through it. Brand new nuggets are being born left and right. And uh, we're doing pretty good here, guys. We're doing pretty good. I, I hope that... I don't think the stone huts will actually upgrade at this version of the game. But it's really fun to see the possibility that they could. And yeah, look at this. I have nuggets like busy, busy, busy picking things up. And I guess just putting them straight down. Huh. What are you doing, lady? She doesn't seem to have any idea where she wants to go or what she wants to do. But we have a whole bunch of resources down here on the ground. So hopefully they'll all figure it out. Oh my goodness. But all right. Okay. So next plan. We're researching the very last things that we need. I'm going to try to figure out how to most efficiently use these couriers. Oh, look at the teacher. That's really cute. How to most efficiently use the couriers. Because right now, going to couriers, doing nothing. And then he's like picking something up, going to couriers. Because that's kind of confusing. Just plopping down to the stockpile quickly. And maybe I can figure out what I'm supposed to use them for. Hmm. All right, well, we'll go ahead and we'll try to keep expanding. I'm kind of sad that we're finishing up the last things that we can actually research, but let's see if next time we will actually have the opportunity. Is it unlocked? It is unlocked. We can build town hall. They'll finally begin to automate tasks and organize themselves more efficiently. <gasps> that might actually make things happen. Okay. So we're going to continue to build. We're going to continue to uh, try to get the population really up. I'd love to try to get to 200. And we will try to spread our nuggets out throughout the entire planet next time. So I'll see you guys then. Bye-bye.